udah kami buat nah, udah kami buat is to encourage and request all the defaulters in Kirinyaga County to come forward and pay up their plots so that there are adults and the ground rents so that the county can have enough money to give service. It's also important for all the defaulters to know and all the Kirinyaga residents to know that if we get this money and uh, if the Kirinyaga County can get enough money to give service, we shall be able to improve our own, even to expand our market. We have a number of things that the county uh, is looking for and to do, but uh, we cannot do without, without enough uh, revenue. So I'm encouraging all the devoters and even those people who have also in the single business license who have not paid to come forward and pay so that we can have enough money to give service to the people of Kirinyaga. Sia <laughs> Na to giaga kuko to na bea siya kuiga na to tigwa ta kubeko. Kwa nende ya uliya, alea matarute te besa, siya siya teli, magerie kurutana ihenya, na nigo to gena besa, siya kuhata kuhaya na service. Na nigo mwoto wadha wa kire nyaga, ahota ukenerera umidhio wa county ya kire nyaga. So in the county government of kire nyaga, the department of lands is owing the county in terms of revenue, uh, over 200 million shillings, and this uh, monies are spread to the owners of plots and land who have not paid their land rates and rents. And we have, we printed on the nation newspaper, we placed an advert on 17th of March, uh, whereby we collected a list of defaulters amounting to 1,876 and they are owing the county uh, close to 257 million shillings. And we have strategies in which to raise the same. Number one, we've published the names so they are aware. Number two, we've also gone around broadcasting using uh, the communication department vehicle, and they have gotten information. We've also used the churches to reach out to them. And then number four, We've also gotten in touch by calling them through texts and phone calls. Some of them have started to respond and they are coming, they are paying. 
and we have given a deadline of up to this March 31st. Those who have not have complied, uh, the following will happen. Number two, there will be a penalty. And number, two, uh, number one, there will be a penalty. And then number two, we will commence steps for recovering that plot, for repossessing that plot. Those of us from Kirinyaga who, who can remember what happened in Sagana in 1996, people were given notice. And some of them complied. But there was a huge number that refused to comply. And that is exactly what happened. Those who paint, up after the notice expired, they paint with the penalty. And after the period of application of the penalty expired, the plots were repossessed and issued to other citizens of this county who were able now to be paying land rates and also to be paying rents accordingly. So I'm pleading with the people of Kirinyaga, the plot owners, we have your data, come out in your thousands as individuals, come and have your record straightened up. If you don't do that, you only have yourself to blame. Thank you.